Dr. Kimumi Adeshina has been sworn in as the re-elected president of the African Development Bank. Nigeria's former Minister of Agriculture and Rural Development was re-elected on August 27 to serve a second five-year term after a unanimous vote of all governors, regional and non-regional members of the bank. Aneta Felix has details. And will regulate my conduct as president. And will regulate my conduct as president. With the interest of the bank only in view. With the interest of the bank only in view. So, so help, help me, me God. God. <laughs> Akinwumi Adishino takes his oath of office as he's sworn into office as the re-elected president of the African Development Bank Group. The swearing-in ceremony of the 8th AFDB president is taking place in Abidjan, Côte d'Ivoire, in the presence of heads of states, governors, members of the AFDB group, and hundreds of stakeholders who tuned in virtually. Additional had polled 100% of votes of all 54 regional and 27 non-regional members of the bank after a five-year tenure in which the bank approved a $10 billion facility to support African countries to address the COVID-19 pandemic, Additional now pledges to do more in his second term. We're going to work hard to strengthen our institutional capacity, to improve human resources, to build a top-notch IT capacity, to enhance effectiveness and productivity, Present and former African presidents congratulated Adesina on his re-election while promising their support for his second term. Dr. Adesina, you have our full support as you continue to lead the African Environment Bank through this COVID-19 period. Dr. Adesina worked with me as my Minister for Agriculture and Natural Resources, and I know what is made up of and I believe it will not disappoint the shareholders. Congratulations. The AFDB was founded in 1964 to promote economic development and the social progress of Africa, and members of the board expressed confidence that additional would deliver on that mandate. Aneta Felix, PLOS TV Africa. Thank you, Aneta.